Hello, and welcome back to Wuppo. There were some weird stutters in the last video. I have no idea what caused that. It was just in the recording itself. For some reason, I can't even blame OBS like I normally do, because I'm recording this with DxTory, since the Steam overlay actually works with it, unlike most games for some reason. So I don't know what that was. I hope it doesn't happen again. It definitely wasn't in the game because I didn't notice it whatsoever. So yeah, fingers crossed that things will just go fine from now on. Beyond that, I've played a little bit since last time. I replayed the entire game on just easy mode because I wanted to test. So today we're going to get the Ultra Bucket, but I also wanted to do... No, I don't. <laughs> I, I wanted to maybe do some Fortunus fortune-telling, like, uh, happiness hints and just reading what they write about all the happiness. But then I figured, oh, but I should do that in a new save where I haven't gotten any happiness. I haven't collected, like, film strips, I haven't done any good deeds for anyone, I haven't been nice to anyone, and just go there with a ton of smirt from Weiss's Wum and just, like, dump it all on... Splank Hacker Coins, which, by the way, they're not called Splank Hacker Coins, that's completely false. They're called Wonder Splank Coins, or Wonder Coins, I think it was Wonder Splank Coins. Uh, we can check, hold on. Oh no, that's the wrong thing. Uh, doesn't say here. Uh, should I bother going there? We can check once we get there, I'm gonna go fetch the other two store artifacts, but yeah, they say, like, trade your smart for Wonder Splank Coins here! Not Splink Hacker Coins, so that Weiss's Wum thing is just completely wrong, which is strange. And then another Weiss's Wum thing, I noticed when trying to just get money for Fortunus. Uh, well, two things. First off, the question that is 2 plus 2 equals 22, which is obviously false, is actually a personal question. You can say true, and he just says, I'm bad at math, and you get it. But the one that's 2 plus 2 equals 4, you cannot say false on. That, you have to actually know that much math, which is uh, pretty mean. You know, you can't really expect that of everyone. But then also, I got several scores of exactly 200. As it turns out, if you get 27 right answers, then fail one, then get 3 more correct answers. So 30 total and 1 wrong then you get exactly 200 on your score. And it stays in the same bracket. So you actually get 200 smart and you pay 120 smart to play again. So that's the most efficient way to do it. But obviously you can have some RNG where you get 27 right answers and then the next one is a personal question. So you can't answer it or you'll go over. Then you just have to sit at like 196 points, which is fine. But yeah, just interesting little tidbit. But when I got to Fortunus, I started just testing it out with, like, over a hundred Wondersplank coins. And there was so much reading. I just kind of skipped and skimmed through it, and it just kept going. About, like, not even the hard types of happiness. So I think I'm just gonna ignore that for now. I might do a full, like, read episode. We'll see where I just go through in that save. I still have it. Just as much as many hints as I possibly can and just reading them all and killing my voice and probably taking more than an entire episode to do so. But for now, I'm gonna ignore that and then towards the end of this run, we'll see if I've forgotten some happiness on the way when I'm like done and I'm ready to fight, uh, what's his face? Bankrent? If I'm like 197, 194 happiness, whatever, then, or life, then I'll go and get some hints. So, let's get to it. Let's just get some uh, store artifacts, because yeah, I do need the one from the Blyans and the one from the Wum House. And I guess I might as well get the Wum House one first, because then we can just jump off the Wum House. That's probably faster. And we have to go... Uh, where is it? I mean, I guess I can just go here. It doesn't matter. I need to go to the roof anyway. Yeah, this is pretty close. Oh fuck, I hit floor 5, not the roof.
All right, so you... I have the sword effect, too. Yeah, they're only 240. Okay, I'm way over. I could even pick up some black cake, but... Maybe I... I want to wait with that, too, because it's like... I want to buy some black cake. I think you could get... What was it? Five or three uh, happiness from black cake? And then I want to, like, talk about the happiness hints. Get a hint for black cake, then eat one, then get a hint for another one, and so on. I don't even know. I'll wait with it for now and just get this one. Well, it's daytime. We have a pretty little song playing. Oh! What? Number 1337. Room doesn't exist. Huh? Uh... Oh, shit. I I jumped too high. I hope I'm still recording. I mean, I'm, I'm still recording. I don't know what happened in between if it went to a different recording there. Because it kind of like, it came up with an error and stuff. I jumped above this screen and nothing is there. Because you can just jump too far off the, the bum house. I think I tried that in the Let's Play and didn't manage to do it. But I guess I did now. I mean, seems like we're fine still. It seems like there's nothing to worry about. So I'm just gonna keep going. I hope that doesn't cause any weird issues to happen. No, oh, he's got like a hat. That's, he looks different. And yeah, he doesn't have anything interesting either. Yeah, just get the store artifact and get out of here. Yeah, that's very strange, that you can get to a screen that doesn't exist. And why is it number 1337? Is is it actually that, or is that just, like, a joke, because funny number? Is there one called 420 and 69 as well? Seven minutes! I mean, it's gonna take a little time to get over to the islands and get the bucket and then go back. I might have time to catch that train. I hope. Oh no, I don't want to be here. There we go. Buy a wonder hat here. And then this guy. Come on. Wonder hats for sale. Maybe I can just talk to him. Throw your smirt on me for Wonder Splink coins. Equip your smirt and throw it on me. Like I said, they call it Wonder Splink coins. It's incorrect. The quiz is not right. Yeah, that's... I should probably put that in the bug report or something. Also, is it faster to just swim here? It might be. Oh, it's just right here. And this guy had a film strip as well. So I'll get that. You can see the film strip here. When I buy it, does it disappear? Yeah, we have these as well. Yeah, sure. It's most of my smirt, but whatever. Yeah, the film strip is gone. Interesting. So this should be some more happiness. Yeah. Because, yeah, I'm just going to keep going with the happiness for right now. And then we have store artifact. One was, like, here? No. Uh, here? God damn it. Okay, four was there. Nope. Four was here. Was... This was one? I think that might be it. One, two, three, four. Hats. Uh, bucket. Yeah. It's very complicated. Now, can I put the Blusser outfit on here? No, I cannot. It has to be the bucket. Too bad. Eh. 
And we get the Ultra Bucket. And it works on the Blusser outfit as well, so I don't even need to change from this one. Come on, start whistling. I can't... can't whistle. I'll have to check. Hold on, I'll just get to the station. I want to make sure I'm there before the seven minutes, but it hasn't been seven minutes. It's been like two minutes, right? So we're still going to have to wait a long, 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 long time. And there's nothing else I can do, right? I mean, it's just like watching film strips, but that's not really great. There's nothing I can do in the WUM house, meanwhile. It's four minutes. It's not the worst thing in the world. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I can do anything else. But yeah, let's let's see again. There we go. It just seemed like it was harder to get started with this one. Let me try it on the normal one. No, I guess it's just... I, you have to start whistling before you start shooting. So I, I do it like simultaneously, but you have to start clicking right click, then hold down left click, and then you can do it forever. Yeah, there we go. Was there anything else I wanted to buy from here? I did want to test those rainbow things, but... That's kind of a waste of smirk, but maybe, maybe I'm fine with that. I think I'll get this one as well. It's kind of a fun one. I like this one more than the normal bazooka. Yeah, I don't like this one much. Yeah, it's these ones. They're not that. Uh, structured rainbow pattern. This is randomized rainbow colors. This is rainbow glow or something pretty expensive but I'm gonna get one of each and this one also has a glow so I could get that on the bazooka but can you get that on like the skins as well oh god I, I have to test that so much smirk but again we can get more it's fine I was gonna buy more blappuccino but no that I can't even do that on the way down I have to do that on the way up so never mind the only thing I could do would be to, like, play Wisest 1 once on the way down and just beat my score. Because I know I can. My score wasn't even that good. It was, like, what, 600 and something? Or was it 500? Maybe I'll do that just to get a tiny bit more on the way down. And I do just like Wisest 1. I think it's a fun game mode. So now I can do that and have the bazooka. Nice. Now this one looks more intimidating. And then we still have the fire effect here. And we have the buster suit. It's kind of fun. Well, I'll just be back when I'm at Weiss as well, I suppose. Oh, and by the way, the minigame in the train has not changed at all, so you're not missing anything. I just noticed there's, like, idle animations on the Blusser suit. Where you, like, fall asleep and stuff. Sort of. Hold on, and then when you sleep properly, yeah, like that, and then when you wake up, you kind of, like, jump up a little bit. Yeah, they definitely put some effort in to these, like, DLC things, which, you know, makes sense. Knowing that this is a shit weapon, I, I think this shouldn't even exist in the DLC. I, I mean, obviously, the DLC doesn't exist anymore, it's free, but even beforehand, if that weapon wasn't there and it was just cosmetics, everything, it's just cosmetics and you can change the way you look in the uh, skins for weapons and gum core, fire... Thing, which looks really nice, then it would be totally fine as a DLC pack. I just didn't like the fact that it was uh, 
It had an actual weapon that you couldn't get otherwise in a DLC pack that felt shitty when it could have been something overpowered, but it wasn't really. Oh shit. I can't even play. I'm not even gonna be able to play Wise's One because I can't pay the entry fee. Damn. I forgot about that. I'm just gonna check. 650? 660 smirt. Yeah, you have to start paying more than you've earned ever before. Ah, that's a shame. I wanted to play it, but I wasted too much money on random nonsense that I didn't need. Oh well. At least this guy isn't mad at me now. He, he just left. He was like, let me in, and then just left. Wait, couldn't you talk to this guy? Are you enjoying your coffee hat? It's even better than I expected. Thanks for letting me know. Yeah, and then you get plus one. Nice. I'm satisfied. New Popolon. Yeah, I guess uh, Popo City hasn't like returned to normal yet because I need to watch that cutscene of New Popolon being built. Uh, so... I have to do this thing. And then she has... Randomized rainbow colors, again. Structured rainbow pattern. So it's exactly the same. Let me save again since I ate the contract. And just check. If I just buy those, I just get two, right? Like I'll have two in my inventory of each. Yep. Okay, so that's kind of pointless. Uh, now, first off, I'm gonna try... Uh, I'll try it on the normal gum gum gun. So first off, just randomize rainbow colors, the one that looks like, kind of, crusty. Yeah, it just looks default, basically. And yeah, look, it's the thing again. Like, everything is red. What is this? When you get down here, it looks even weirder. Look, it's all like ominous and red in the background. I don't fucking understand what's happening. Smirt. I don't even need this. Like, what causes this? It's it's daytime, right? Or is it nighttime? But even so, I haven't seen that before. Oh. Oh, you can't put skins in here. Ah, too bad. And then structured rainbow. Ah, I see, it's just not random colors, it's the same colors, but just like, it'll keep going in a rainbow pattern over and over and over, no matter what. Alright, makes sense. And then let's try the glowy one. Yeah. Looks fine, I suppose. The splashes look kind of neat, but not better than the fire one. But let's try with rapid fire to see if it looks better there. No, this doesn't look better. The uh, fire is definitely the best one for this gum core. So let's load. And let's try it on the bazooka. I can't do it on the bucket, right? Nope. Bucket not allowed. And yeah, these ones not allowed. So just try the bazooka with a glowy rainbow, I guess? Because why not? Gotta make use of it. Yeah, they're glowing, and then... That looks kind of cool. Yeah, why not? That's fine. It's, like, not that different, honestly, but it's a very subtle thing. And then, I can't do... 
I bought this as well, but I can only use that on this one or that one, right? I believe so, yeah. Yeah. Alright, well, I mean, again, I have it. Might as well just put it on the bazooka, even though I won't even use the bazooka, because I have the new skin that I like. Oh! It works on the skin! Hey, that's nice! I have a giant glowy cannon. That's cool. I wasn't expecting that to actually work. Alright, nice. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh, they changed. Now it's channel weed and a battery. Uh, I guess I might as well go down here because the the tram isn't moving. Wait, can I force the tram to move with my popo hat? Cause fuck you, tram. I wanna I wanna go. Looks like it's closed here. Damn. Yeah, it's the other one that you can go with. Yeah. Can't do anything. So I just have to walk over again. And I'm hoping for a blow nut on the way. Alright, we got something here. Fuck you. Ah, nothing good. Oh yeah, you don't even need the swimming suit anymore. The water is clean. Hold on, let me just buy two more. Come on, blow nuts. Oh, well, that's not terrible. That's more money for me. But yeah, no blow nuts. And I don't know if you can buy it somewhere. But anyway, I think that's gonna have to be it. Oh, Kneft, can you kill them? I'll have to check. That'll be it for this one. Next time, I guess we'll clean up here in Popa City. There's like the fried smack muffle I need to give to the electricity guy. And there's, uh, I don't know if I need to do a city hall thing or deliver newspapers or if there's anything else that gives happiness. I'm not too sure. We'll just check it out a little bit and then head over to the Fnacker village. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Bye bye.